So you want to link a custom button to URL in DaVinci Resolve. Let's see how to do it. In DaVinci Resolve, search for Fusion Composition. Let's add a Fusion Composition to our timeline. And we go to the Fusion tab. To be able to add the button, we need to add a custom control. And to add a custom control, you must have at least one node. So here I will add a transform node. Control space to open the tools and search for transform. Edit. Let's link this to the media out. To add a custom control or a custom button in DaVinci Resolve, you need to right click to the node. Go to edit controls. Here we will type the name of the button. I will type my website name, but you can type anything that you want. You can link the button to your website or your YouTube channel. And now in the page, we need to select in which page the button will be shown. In which tab, I want it to be shown to the controls tab, so it's going to be shown here. This control will not be animatable. We don't need to add keyframes to it, so I will uncheck it and I will make it passive. In the input control, scroll down. When you see the button control, click it. For the width, you can add a width. This field accepts values from 0 to 1. So it goes from 0% to 100% width. I will put 1 here. And in the execute field, we will need to add a command that allows us to open an URL from a custom button in DaVinci Resolve. And here we will need to put this command. So it's OS execute start. And in this section between this double quotes, you need to put your URL. And once I hit OK, you will see the button here, which if I click it, it will open my website on my default browser. Now to edit the control, all you have to do is right click on the node, go to edit controls in the drop down, in the ID drop down, go and select your button. Usually it's by the end of the list and click the name of the control and here you can edit your URL and then hit OK. To add the control to a macro, it is very easy. Right click on this node, macro, create macro and scroll down until you see the name of the control which is here. Just check it and the custom button control will be added to your macro. So this was a short tutorial which showed you how to link custom control to a URL in DaVinci Resolve. If you like more tutorials like this, make sure to subscribe to my channel and with you guys see you in the next one. Thank you for watching and bye.